In this video, I'm going to show you how to do a write on effect using DaVinci Resolve and Fusion. Ooh, how do we do that? So we select our clip, we go into the Fusion page, and we add a paint node. We change the paint node from multi stroke to single stroke. We change our color if we want, we don't have to, optional. And then we go into brush control, optional, change the size. I select this bit smaller one. And then we go into stroke controls, stroke animation, change that from all frames to right on. So right on. And I like to have my keyframes open. So I press that one so I can see my keyframes. Press that one to frame all. And now I'm going to just draw a picture around here like that. And then we boop, boop. Okay, and then you can see here that it started making keystrokes for every single um, part of the curve. So if I press play right here, it will write them all on at the same time. And it was sort of too late as well. So I want to move the timing of all of these. So if I just press the, each curve and press, uh, I can either do shift, I think, and grab them all, or control to grab them individually. So they're going to start happening here. And then I want, um, to move my first one earlier, my second one earlier, and then the third one, etc., etc. You get the picture, and then so these are each stroke, and I'm just making them sequential. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do a write-on effect using DaVinci Resolve and Fusion. Ta-da! Now, if I wanted to speed those up, I would go into the spline editor and I have to select the paint. Oh, yes, it's weird. Like sometimes it doesn't appear. So I just click through all of them until this appears. And then you press the frame all here. And this shows you all the curves of each one of these. So if I select one, that'll be you know, the first one down here and the second one or the third and blah, 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 blah. But I'm just going to grab them all with this button this little uh, squash and stretch thing. So you highlight that one and then you drag it over all of your curves. And now you get a, a big box that as you stretch it, it'll take all of the curves inside and stretch them to over the edge. I'll just show you much easier. So here we go. We're going to speed it all up and you can see that the it's compressing. I'm pointing at the screen. It's compressing the timeline and all of the frames. So now it'll write on quicker. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to do a write on And actually, I'm just going to move you all. Let's move you that way a bit as well because you're coming on a bit quick. Where was my first frame? And we want to start around about there. Okay. I'm show you how to do a write on. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do a write on effect using DaVinci Resolve and Fusion. Look at that. That's great. All right, then come out of that and then we're on our timeline. And there we are. The world of magic. You have to do a write on effect using DaVinci Resolve and Fusion. <laughs> All right. Thanks. Bye.